At least 41 people killed in Egypt church fire. A fire sparked by an electrical fault at a packed church in a working class district of Greater Cairo has killed at least 41 people and injured another 45, Egyptian officials have said. About 5,000 people had gathered at the Coptic Abu Shifan Church in Mbaba Giza for a Sunday morning service. When a fire broke out just before 9 a.m. local time, flames and smoke block an entrance to the church, causing a crowd crush. Security sources told Reuters, adding that most of those killed were children. Some people jumped from higher floors in an attempt to escape. Witnesses said, "People were gathering on the third and fourth floor, and we saw smoke coming from the second floor." Said Yasir Munir, a worshipper on the ground floor, who managed to escape with his daughter. People rushed to go down the stairs and started falling on top of each other. Then we heard a bang and saw spark and fire coming out of the window. The church reportedly included a nursery for children. Witnesses describe how people rushed into the burning building to rescue those trapped. It. But were soon overwhelmed by the heat and smoke. Ameya Reda Banmumi, who lived next to the church, told agencies Fran Press, "Everyone was carrying kids out of the building, but the fire was getting bigger, and you could only go in once, or you would asphyxiate." Fifteen firefighters' vehicle had managed to put out the blaze in a narrow street by Sunday afternoon. While footage from the scene circulated online showed damage to the church, including burned wooden furniture, worry families waited outside for news about missing loved ones. Egypt authoritarian president Abdel Fattah Al Sisi said in a tweet, "I offer my sincere condolences to the families of the innocent victims that have passed on to be with their Lord in one of His houses of worship." Cc also spoke by phone with the Pope of the Coptic Orthodox Church, Tawadros II, to offer his condolences. The president's office said, Sheikh Ahmed Al Tayab, the Grand Imam of Cairo's influential Al Zaha Mosque, also offer his condolences. The Prime Minister and other senior government officials. Arrived to inspect the site later on Sunday, as the Prosecutor General Hamada El Sawi ordered an investigation. The Interior Ministry, which oversees Egypt police and firefighter, said an initial report found that the fire broke out on the second floor in an air conditioner, which then short circuited, producing huge amount of smoke. Smoke inhalation was the main cause of death. It said. Egypt Christian account for about 10 percent of the country's more than 103 million people, and have long complained of the discrimination by the nation Muslim majority. Sunday blaze was one of the worst fire tragedy in recent years in Egypt, where safety standard and fire regulations are poorly enforced. In March last year, a fire at garment factory near Cairo killed at least 20 people. And injure twenty-four more. That's it for today. Thank you and goodbye.